guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I'll be reacting to episode 1 of season 3, part 2 of Attack on Titan. I'm not ready for this. Realizing that so many characters that I like <laughs> are gonna die in 10 weeks, or really 9 weeks now, is heartbreaking, and I have guesses, but I think I'm gonna wait either until the opening comes up to talk about them, or until the end of the episode, so other than that, let's go ahead and get started in 3... Two, one, go. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't want to watch A squirrel. Mm. Honey. Mm. Why am I fucking crying? I know I'm crying. Because all the people who I care about are going to fucking die. So I've already heard the song, I've seen the opening in a way, and somebody like commented on it saying that like the opening is kind of really spoiler, spoilery, as someone who doesn't know anything, because I haven't read the dang manga, I mean, it could literally mean anything, just future things that are going to happen in this 10 episode, second core, it's just, ugh. I'm fucking scared, so okay. As of right now, I only really have two people who I automatically think are going to die because I just feel like there's not going to be a lot of, there's going to be character development in this, like, second half of the series for them, but slowly but surely they're going to die. That is Erwin and Sasha. I just, like, believe that their time is up. That they're, like, Erwin's going to maybe sacrifice himself. Sasha, I don't know yet. I, give me, like, three or four episodes, and then I could change my mind. I think maybe Adamine might get hurt, maybe lose his legs or something. I don't know. Might go in a coma. I, I don't know. Everything's just guesses. It's just, I'm just fucking scared. And then what the fuck is in that damn face that we're finally gonna find out? But just, mm. Uh, huh? Okay. <laughs> What's up, Jane? Oh, okay. You know, um, so I would be. Oh, mm -mm. See, that remind me of the suicide forest in Japan when the four idiots went and that dude screamed. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Oh, 
please. It's okay to be scared. I mean, you're going back home, honestly. <laughs> of course, we gotta take it. Bullshit. <laughs> oh, I mean. Please don't kill my son. I love him too damn much. I hope so. Oh my god, do you just stop? Damn it. <laughs> no one's dying yet. So why am I crying? And see, the weirdest thing is, like, in the back of my mind, I keep thinking of that final scene we saw in October that was, like, the worst. And that's just, like, haunting me. I just I immediately always think about the freaking charred body and who the freak that was. <laughs> No. 
or somewhere in town. I wouldn't be surprised if they just came out like right now. That and it feels a little too easy. But it's coming. I know it is. I'm not ready for this. Nope, nope, Good. It's fine. Sorry, no. See, it, it just feels too freaking easy. They're gonna come out, and I know it. I just don't know when. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because there was some new waiting for your asses to come. Yeah, whoever the freaking guy is inside of the Beast Titan, which we still don't know. Some of y'all know. I don't know shit. Yeah, but they're hiding. The thing is, they're waiting for, like, the perfect time to just come out and kick y'all out. Mm 
Oh, damn. Shit, I'd be nervous about that, too. See, I feel like possibly the group that's going to go in the basement, it's going to be Erwin. I don't know who else, but... <clears throat> like, what if they wait in the basement? Think about that. Are you talking about the stuff that can turn someone else into a titan? That's what they got to be talking about. But then who would you want to, who would you want to turn into a Titan? If it is that. True. I completely forgot about that till now. Shit. They're in the wall. Possibly. No, break the damn wall. Just no, come on, just trust him. Just do it. You have to. Oh, I think something's going to happen in a second. You got something. Oh, God. Wow. 
Oh shit. Um This episode's all oh god, we got three minutes left. behind you. Damn. Damn it. I told you! I told you they were dying! Oh my god. Nope. No. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Y'all not ready. Nope. I'm not ready. If I see to be continued right there. Okay, thank God. Just, it, it, it's, but it's coming though. Okay, okay, that was a really nice way to end this first episode, like, 10 out of 10. I still think Sasha and Erwin are going to die unless something, like, changes my mind within the next few weeks. I think if I could add, like, one more person besides Adamine, because Adamine is with a question mark right now, I could maybe say, um, Coney? Uh, no to Jean, because I think Jean is really important, maybe possibly for future arcs in the show, or in the manga. Um, no for Levi, because Levi, he's the best character, and I don't think they could kill him. I think if they killed, if he killed Levi, that's kind of killing the show, so no. Um, but, oh God, I, I really think, um, both Reiner and Wesley Space, they're gonna die in this show, too. Because I feel like their time is up as well. I don't think the guy, whoever the Beast Titan is, he's not going to die. Um, because possibly he's too important and they're going to like want to protect him, maybe. But I, I told you, it, it felt too easy. It, it was right there. <laughs> I'm not ready to cry throughout this dang show. Like, oh, God. Mm-mm. I'm not ready for this. Like, I mean, this was just the calm for the storm. And then they give you that last moment. They're like, hmm, you ready for next week? I mean, between this and Game of Thrones coming out tonight. Holy shit. <sighs> no. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I mean... Uh, and I just feel at the same time, like, what freaking Irwin said, oh, we have that, like, special thing. We have something that they don't know about. It has to be that serum to turn someone into a titan. But as I said during the episode, who is going to make that sacrifice? I mean, I could see Kony. I could see Jean. Maybe Adamine. Adamine is, like... Shit, I gotta come think about it. I mean, would maybe be like, as of right now, maybe top. Because I feel like this second half of the show is going to focus a lot on Adamine. And I feel like by the end of this, he's just gonna be a complete and total badass. And I'm gonna love him even more. Um, maybe... Maybe Levi? But I, I, I don't know. Like, I don't think Levi would wanna take on that responsibility. It's gotta be someone... Who is like immediately like all that hesitation and stuff, seeing having everything in the background right now, seeing people die right in front of them every single like few seconds or minutes or so, and if it's right there in front of them, they just can't hesitate. They just gotta take it, do that, and then just turn into a titan. 
So, I, yeah, just those three. Those are the only thing I can think about right now. I, I literally have no one else. Unless Mikasa, maybe? But no. Like, I don't think... She's already badass enough. She doesn't need to be a titan. I don't know. I really don't know. I'm just, I'm trumped. And I'm going to Walmart in a couple minutes. So I'll be thinking about this in fucking Walmart. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to towards episode 50 of season 3, part 2 of Attack on Titan. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Magical Squad. And of course, I will see you guys all officially next Sunday for episode 51. Bye, guys.